Hello and welcome back. If you're new here, my name is Aileen Senpai. I am a streamer on Twitch, an amateur singer, and a lover of all kinds of music. Now recently, I got into Falling in Reverse when we first listened to Zombie Fight together, and I thought it was absolutely fucking incredible. Uh, I am very, very much excited because I feel like I've been missing out on so much Falling in Reverse, and this song we're doing today was so highly requested in my comments. We're going to be diving into Popular Monster. I'm so excited to see what else Ronnie Wadke can do because Zombified literally destroyed me and my brain got fried from it. It was so damn amazing, but I'm so excited to dive into this with you guys. And I'm, I don't even, I'm not even going to, you know, talk much because I just want to shut up and get to the video. All I want to say is, you know, if you enjoy my falling in reverse reactions, please consider leaving a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell so you never miss another video ever again. But that being said, let's get started with Popular Monster by Falling in Reverse. up every morning with my head up in a daze i'm not sure if i should say this fuck i'll say it anyway everybody tries to tell me that i'm going through a phase i don't know if it's a phase i just want to feel okay yeah i battle with depression but the question still remains is this post-traumatic stress or am i suppressing rage and my doctor tries to tell me that i'm going through a phase yeah it's not a fucking phase i just want to feel okay okay yeah i struggle with this bullshit every day and it's probably because my demons simultaneously rage it Holy, holy shit. Hold on. I, I was not expecting him to start rapping. Uh, I, I guess I guess Ronnie Radke is capable of everything because Jesus Christ, that was so fucking good. Um, yeah, I sadly can kind of understand what he's, you know, saying. I am late to the Falling in Reverse party, but I've known of the controversies. And I mean, at this point, I'm just like, I, I can't cast judgment on someone I don't know. I honestly... It's it's not it's not my business, and you know I I'm no I know he's gone through a lot, and there's people who probably you know say horrible things to him every single day. So that right there, him being the popular monster, no, I get it. Uh, it must be so horrific just to have people act like they know you when they know nothing about you, and you know they just paint you out as this monster. And you know he's talking about depression, and sadly I understand that I. You know, I've been on antidepressants, anti-anxiety medicine, have gone to therapy for a really long time. And, you know, people always around me are just like, people don't get it. They're like, oh, why are you sad? Just be happy. I'm just like, oh, yeah, why didn't I think of that sooner? Like, it's not that simple. And people around him, probably in his ear, uh, you know, all the comments, all the, you know, people, people have to say on social media, you know, people hide behind keyboards and feel so brave. And, you know, they feel like they know somebody and... It's just so frustrating. I can't even imagine someone in his position. Uh, he is extremely well known. And so that first rap did not miss a beat. It was just so damn powerful. And I, you know, I I, I feel horrible that he ha probably has to hear all of this all the time. But wow, I, I get why y'all were telling me to listen to this song because I am completely blown away by this already. And we're not even a minute in. Um, So I, I went back just a little because I really liked what he did with that note there. I thought it sounded fucking incredible. So I want to hear it one more time. So I'm going to shut up now. Let's continue with the video. trapped in a maze every wall that i knock down is just a wall that i replace i'm in a race against myself i try to keep a steady pace how the fuck will i escape if i never close my case oh my god i keep on stressing every second that i waste is another second sooner to a blessing i won't take but my therapist will tell me that i'm going through a stage yeah it's not a fucking stage i just want to feel okay okay motherfucker now you got my attention i need to change a couple things cause something is missing and what if i was a lie tell you everything I get closer to the grave I am
Holy fuck. <sighs> that was everything I didn't even know I needed, but I'm so I'm so fucking grateful that I heard this because this is this was this was fucking amazing. Ronnie, Ronnie fucking Radke, Ronnie Radke did that and I <laughs> I didn't even know he could rap. Uh I, I'm glad I know that. I wonder if there's any other songs where he raps, because you know, usually uh, you know, sometimes when I'm, you know, hearing like metal metalcore type of music mixed with the rap, a lot of the times the rap doesn't make any sense. But the fact that this has so much sustenance and, you know, this came from a place of anger and frustration and he did not miss a beat. Like everything in there, all every note, I was just like, holy shit, like that hit me. Uh, I know I am nowhere near his stature whatsoever. Um, but again, I feel like a lot of us, you know, sadly can, you know, relate to having the depression and anxiety feeling like, nobody understands you telling you just be happy stop being sad and you you just feel like alone and frustrated like you don't know me you don't know what i'm feeling so how can you tell me what's best for me when you have no idea what's going on in my mind and um of course i know there has been controversy people being you know disgusting to him which you know nobody deserves that and i feel like a lot of times people forget we can't judge somebody we don't know we're not in his position like why it's none of our business at the end of the day and he did kind of touch on a little bit of religion towards the end, and I'm glad he did. Um, he said, uh, you know, where the fuck is your God now in that, you know, breakdown? And that gave me so many chills because sadly, a lot of the times people who are the most religious and always preach only God can judge are the ones usually judging the most, which is the sad truth. And I love that he said that. I, I love that he doesn't care. He doesn't care to offend he doesn't care what he has to say and i love that he's just unapologetically himself and you know i i i'm not gonna judge him i don't i i don't even care what he's gone through but you know I, it's not my place and i feel like a lot of times people need to remember to kind of stay in their lane um but i i thought that was amazing i loved the drums the guitar everything was so great of course his voice is fantastic uh it was also interesting because his rap voice was a lot deeper and he can hit some pretty good highs so he has just such an incredible range and his screams were so good that breakdown it i feel like i just i i gave it added like 10 years to my life that breakdown was so fucking great um i feel like i <laughs> it's so funny because i don't cuss really on my reaction channel i cuss a lot in person and on my twitch channel but on my reaction channel i'm usually very tame but even when i heard zombie fight i think i said i dropped like a million f-bombs there's just something about falling in reverse that's just like i feel alive i feel exhilarated i feel like i just came back from a freaking run or something but wow uh ronnie fucking radke that was that was so good and i cannot wait to hear more i know i have to do a uh trilogy i have that on my list so don't worry that's coming up very soon I am not done listening to Falling in Reverse, so don't worry about that. More in the future. Uh, but if you enjoyed this video, please be sure to, you know, leave this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and ring that bell so you never miss another video ever again. I am going to uh, try to, you know, piece myself together and pick up, you know, <laughs> the brain fragments that, you know, flew all over my room because that was, that was a lot, but in the best way possible. And I am just, I'm just so damn happy I got to hear this with you guys. Thank you again for the recommendation because that was fucking great. Um, but other than that, if you want to hang out with me, I do live stream on Twitch every Monday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday at 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. But other than that, I have videos every single day on this channel, so stay tuned. But, you know, until next time, enjoy yourself. Remember, I love you so damn much. And until tomorrow, I'll see you very soon. Bye!